Hey, what's going on guys? Today I'm showing you the new addition to Neon Industries. That's right, I added a power plant to Neon Industries. Well, not exactly added to it, I added it roughly, like, pretty far away from it actually. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna give you a Anyway, we're going to give you a brief tour. Here is our water tanks on this side on the left, and here is our engine lubricant on the right, and our natural gas on the right. We also have inlet ports for both the engine lubricant and the natural gas. Now this goes both over there to the tanks, and also to our combined cycle gas turbines. Now there is two of these for independent uh, power systems. Now. If the, one of these were to fail, there is a something I'll there's something I'll show you later, which would help uh, with the whole situation. Anyway, so basically, our fuel goes in this side, or not, our um, our lubricant goes in this side, our water goes in here as well, gets turned into dense steam. Now, then steam comes out this pipe here and into our big ass steam turbine here, and then that comes out. Uh, that makes it into steam, and then that steam comes out and goes into the industrial steam turbines here. And then the byproduct of that is low pressure steam, which then goes to this cooling tower here. And then what, what that does, it turns it back into water and then sends it back through the loop to start again. Pretty exciting. And then we have our substation here. This is, we have three of these for each power line. So here's our first substation here our first set and here's our second set so it takes the power from in here from all three generators here pokes it out the wall here and then sends it to all of these bad boys and then take the uh, power here and that's right we send it to neon industries this is actually pretty far surprisingly that is also pretty good this also has on-site power so like if the uh, power plant over there decide to fail then we're still good all right here is our substations here which then go into into the plant, or not the plant, Neon Industries. And this goes into a breaker room right here. This is our main power bypass that I told you about earlier, which takes our one existing steam turbine's energy and sends it to both uh, buses here. It's usually off, like if it needs to be on, we can just do that. So yeah, there's that, which then sends our power into both of these at the same time. Look at that. Here's our power converter disconnect, which is used for our induction matrix thingamabobber. I forgot what it's called. <laughs> and then here's our radar system power disconnect. As you can hear, it's working very well. Ding. All right, and then we have our power converter, HE to RF converter, which powers this thing here, which is our ME system. Good stuff. And what our other subsystems are in this facility, I forgot about. It's been a while since I've worked on this, honestly. Oh, yeah, I forgot about our secret tunnel down here. Yes, alright, so this is getting power as well from something. That's our backup power that I was talking about, apparently. <laughs> Look at that, even got a backup generator, which is currently empty. Wow, okay, <laughs> we might have filled that up. Okay, anyway, that's that. Good stuff. And here's our main power here. I don't know why this thing is not storing more power, but regardless, I ain't worried about it right now. No, it's probably because it's powering everything still. And here's a, yeah, we, like I said, we have a, a ridiculous amount of power options here. And here's our garage. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.